Wait a minute. I should have. I should have also gone to Dell Financial Services, like I said, to do at the uh, end of Dell Saga Five, because there are more of these guys up on sale. Okay. Look, there are 13 of them actually. They're not quite the same, but they're a lot cheaper. It depends on what you need. These all have Windows 7 Pro on them. Okay. These are first generation core i5s, which means that the memory is running at 1066 megahertz, not um, 1333 megahertz. Although, um, like I showed in the comments, um, Dell's saying that they provided a faster speed of RAM and they tested it and it worked. You might want to ask Dell about that. But look, for between 450 and 550, you can pick up one of these. Now here's the problem, and, and, and I always have this problem with Dell websites. See, that seems to say the same thing that this one says. The difference is that this one is cosmetic grade A, and it's more than one. When it says more here, it means that there's a group of them. Okay? They're all the same, but they're in a group. That's cosmetic grade A, and that's cosmetic grade B. Okay? Now, to be honest, I've bought cosmetic grade B and A machines from Dell because I bought like six of them. No, well, let's see. Four, no, four, four or six. One, two. I bought four. I bought four of them um, in since November. And the one, the Dell that I got, that's the 6510, is cosmetic grade A. I can't see a thing wrong with it. Not a thing. It looks brand new. It acts like it's brand new. Okay? So if they're used parts, they must have really cleaned it up. But see, see, this one is selling for 500 I paid 633 for mine right here from this website. But I got 8 gig of RAM and I got an i5 quad. Okay? And then I got a 320 hard drive. So for that extra $100, I got a lot more. Okay? Here it's cosmetic grade B and you get a $70 savings. I the cosmetic grade B machines I bought were dip my desktops and I don't see anything wrong with them. I mean, I think I saw a scuff or two on one of them, but all the all the ports <coughs> the ports look like they're brand new. Okay? They must have redone the ports. In fact, they're so new that I have trouble sticking my USB dongles into them. I have they 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 stick. They're really hard to use at first. That that's what you should expect from a brand new dongle. And then um the one here, this is only an 80 gig hard drive. Okay. But the hard drives are really easy to switch out. Never worry about the size of the hard drive. So if you want to save what is it, a hundred bucks <coughs> But be aware that you're getting i5 and it's dual core, not quad core. Um, if you want to save 100 bucks, you can get this and then you'll pay about $70 for a 500 gigabyte hard drive that's really easy to switch. Okay, so what you do is you get Clonezilla for 8 bucks at Amazon. You clone your Windows 7 Pro machine onto an external hard drive. Okay, and you can pick up a 500 gigabyte external hard drive while well, they're about 60 bucks. Um, but this is only 80, so you could clone your drive to an 80 for like 30 bucks. My 80 gigabyte hard drives at Jacobs Parts cost me 30 bucks. So you could clone it out on an 80 gigabyte hard drive, then buy for $70 um, a 500 gigabyte hard drive from either Dell or Western Digital. They're all available at Dell's site. And, or an SSD if you wanted, and then clone your 80 gigabyte, you know, external drive back to the new one, and you got a whole new system. Okay, so you're really still paying the hundred dollars anyway. Come to think about it, because you got to pay for the well, you got to do the clone anyway, so that doesn't count. But you're paying seventy dollars for the, the 500 gigabyte hard drive, and it's not much cheaper for a smaller. I'm not even sure they sell smaller. I think they sell a 250 for like 60 bucks. So in a way, you're not really losing much if you get this one versus that one. 
And then again, the RAM, the four gigabyte sticks. I just put a comment in my Saga 5. The four gigabyte sticks are 13, 33 megahertz. Um, but I don't know if they'll run on the i5 at that speed. They might run only at 1066 speed. And each four gig costs 33 bucks. So it's cheap enough to upgrade. You know what I'm saying? That's why I got this. Because this is going to be my main video machine after I, you know, I finish kitting it out. Now, do these drives have, do these machines have the, the full HD on them? I don't know. You can't tell from the Dell specs. This one is silver, okay, and it's 240. The processor speed is faster than the i7, but bear in mind that Intel's processors um, are trying to reduce the gigahertz speed. So an i7 doesn't need to run as fast okay in order to be faster that's one of the the tricks about these stupid new vocabulary that I had to learn alright so this one let's see what this one's doing this is the high end okay this one's also silver so they're all silvers they're not blue ah. okay and that's a 250 this is 250 cosmetic grade B for 481 and in its group all of them are also silver okay now when it says these four USB ports they're they're stacked they're two on one side stacked and two on the other side stacked I happen to like that um, and I like to use uh, Patriot although some people complain about Patriot not being useful I like to use Patriot um, flash drives because they fit into those tight spaces and I'm just now getting um, the Kingston because of the color coding on the Kingston. Um, but the Kingston are thicker. I don't know if they're going to fit in an, you know, top and bottom. The Sand Cruiser that I have will not fit. So they're stacked USB ports. Okay, so you might not be able to use, let's say, two Kingston. You might be able to use a Kingston and a Patriot together because the Patriot's footprint is so small. But I'm, you know, that's about all I can say about that. All right. So anyway, that's the story. Sorry to keep up taking up your time, but I thought you might be interested in knowing that if you were interested in bidding at the auction, but you're willing to settle for something a little slower, okay, in order to save money, you got 13 of these babies to choose from right here. End of video.